Alright guys, um, I have separated the, uh, the files out from where they uh, normally go, so yeah, I don't even know what I'm saying here. Um, okay, now, I know there was a bunch of gravel that came out and up and around here, yep, there it is, and uh, I want to try getting to that, because that gravel... Get me out of here! <laughs> um, that what the? Okay, I have to go a little bit out because I want to be. I don't want to have to. Um. Okay, here we go. Uh, do I have anything else that I can build this out? <laughs> one lapis block, one sand block. Now I did see a, a something or other. Oh, it's creeper. Just kill it. I thought it was a skeleton. And a skeleton would easily be able to knock me off of this. Which wouldn't be good, because that'd be like an, a sure death. Or my death at that point would be a sure thing. So, see, we already got our wool from there. I don't remember what wool it was, though. I think it was pink. But I can't be, can't be certain. Hey, buddy. That was weird. That music played like... Lullaby sound. Sounding stuff. I don't know, guys. What's that up there? There's light up there. Maybe it's just that lava. I really hope I didn't just look at an Enderman on accident. Because I thought I might have. Oh dear. Okay, we're good. Let's not go that way. <laughs> Let's go this way, where we can hug the wall. And preferably put torches on the wall. <laughs> on said wall, I should say. Um... Because putting them on the gravel, it's really risky. Okay, you know, I don't see anything. I was expecting this stuff up here to lead to a, uh, a wool somewhere, like, you know, up around here. Because I remembered looking over here and seeing this before and thinking, hmm, I wonder where that goes. And I may have actually said, hmm, I wonder where that goes. But it does not appear that it goes anywhere. At all. So let's, uh, make our way back. Hey, iron. Let's m oh! Oh, no, is Wow, that's trippy. It, that looks like... Did anybody else see that creeper just spawn there? Suddenly and without warning? Like, I can't tell if that's a space right there. Like, that looks like a ledge right there. Uh, to me. Like, the total optical illusion here. Oh, dear God. TNT. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, God. That was scary. I got him. There's zombies right behind me. Oh, jeez. Hey there, buddy. I know you're just looking for friends, but you're looking in the wrong place. Okay, let's try to get back to... I keep forgetting that I don't have, like, a diamond shovel here. Because I keep thinking I'll just... Oh, you know, I'll just one-hit this gravel here, and... We'll be on our way. Then it doesn't happen, and I get all confused, and... Then I start rambling, and... You all get bored and leave, and I'm all alone. I don't know what I'm talking about, guys. I'd highly suggest you don't listen to me. Uh, which would make for a very silent commentary, so never mind. But, uh, don't take me seriously. If I say it, that probably means I don't mean it. So, well, that's totally not true. 
but <laughs> uh, you, you see what I'm getting at there. <laughs> I just totally oxymoron myself. What is down there? This is suspicious. Well, that just pours down there. Okay, is there a... <coughs> wow. My voice totally just cracked. Um, is there a wool somewhere down here? Whoa, hey there, buddy. Whoa, almost fell off. I would like to make all the stalactites here just fall, but I don't know how. <laughs> Gravel works really weird sometimes. So it could be a little rough trying to get it to work with you. doesn't matter if I plug up those holes. It's just... There we go. Oh yeah, if I didn't plug up that other one, I would have had a perfect amount. Whoa! Laggy! Laggy lag. Uh, I don't actually know what time we started this video. Jeez, I really need to start paying attention to things like that more often. But, uh... Okay. Most likely, I'm thinking, we will... Oh, I don't have the diamond armor on me, never mind. Oh, but I can make iron armor here. Unless I grabbed it all. No, there it is. <clears throat> because I don't know how many skeletons we're going to be fighting, and I'd rather have the iron armor on for any and all situations that do not require uh, something. So let's pretend that the green wool is in here. We already found two wools in here, though, didn't we? All these little holes all over the place are going to confuse me a lot. I wonder if things have been spawning in here all over the place since we came through last time. Just because it's still largely unlit. Okay, well, we're much better prepared now than we were the first time we came through here, so... Hopefully... We won't have much problems here, or many problems here. Well, English fail right there. Um, because again, I've I'm pretty well prepared for this. Got a full suit of armor and a diamond sword, and a diamond pick, and I shouldn't have troubles at all. But then again, you never know. Stop it! Stop it! Hey, skeletons. Um. There's some light underwater here. <laughs> There's an arrow sticking out of that one. The fire doesn't do anything to them, but it is a diamond sword, so it should do significant damage. <clears throat> I don't think mobs can spawn on lily pads, can they? Whoa. <laughs> I was not expecting that creeper. I suppose he would be a bad creeper if I was expecting it. But I, still, I feel like there's got to be something up in this tree. Because normally giant trees like this have something in them. Or at least in my experience with Vex's maps. Ah, oh, laggy lag. Oh, jeez. That was bad. Let's make our way out. And I grabbed that respiration helmet uh, because last time we came here there was one thing that had a respiration helmet on it and it was like, hey, use this. So I figured it might be useful. Uh, I think these trees might just be trees. Oh, but that looks interesting. Ow, my legs! 
Oh dear god. Oh, that's just another tree. <laughs> Stupid lily pads. I thought I saw bookshelves, but apparently not. And here's the ow. Here's the wool. There's a battle sign in here. We have lime wool. No, get out. <laughs> the funny thing is that they can't see you behind... Uh... Oh. They can't see you behind the, uh... Leaves and stuff. And man, so many creepers! Alright, the brown wool was over at the, um... Oh, jeez. Uh, the brown wool was over by... Do I hear a blaze? Ow. Ow! Okay, this is... Yeah, fight each other. Um... So many mobs here. I can't say I was expecting that. Especially considering I've already come through here once, you know. I was sitting here thinking it would be easy peasy. Let's get up here. If I can. And we already went up, didn't we? Let's check it again. <laughs> Just to make sure. Because just because we already went up doesn't mean that we uh, actually got the wool. Maybe we just forgot. And by we, I really mean me. But, <laughs> oh well. Whoa, I didn't, like, I... Ugh. Every once in a while I look, oh right, this is the place with all the mushrooms. And the zombies, apparently. I like using the lily pads as little areas that I can just hop on and sprint off of for expediency's sake. For the sake of expediency? For expediency? I don't know how I'd say that. Let's just eat while I'm sinking, since I'm going to be sinking pretty quickly. Uh, out my legs. Okay, which way is out? Let's see, I climbed up a waterfall, of which there are two, but I do believe it was lag. I do believe that was the one I climbed up, which means this side is the side from which I should be exiting. I don't have my falling boots, unfortunately. Alright, out! Oh, well, oh well, doesn't matter. <laughs> I'm down now, so... And all of this is just... Yeah, no, it looks like this area is completely taken care of. Um, I really don't think there's anything left here for us. So, let's go ahead and... I was really hoping it would be here, though, because... I don't... Sorry, it's weirded me out because this was here, that vine. So I was thinking that meant there was something else back there. Oh, lag. Man, I'm sorry for all the lag lately, guys. I really don't know why that's happening. Um, it shouldn't be, as far as I know, but... Okay, let's, uh, we forgot the red wall at the other place. Let's head back to the Victory Monument and examine where things come from. Because... I don't know. <laughs> Um, did I miss something down there? I don't think so. Around at the ceiling. No, nope, don't shoot me off. Oh, you see that arrow just flying over there? Oh, see ya. We already got this wool. Didn't we? Yeah, okay, we got it. We came in from over here. I was like, we did get this wool, right? grab these. These could be useful to us in the future. You know, you never know. 
There's zombies on top. Can you make it to the water from here? Oh, definitely. Whee. Alright, there's iron under there. Hmm. Wow, this takes a long time to swim. I feel like swiftness potions should increase your swimming speed too, but they don't. I do believe they increase your jump distance though, so... That's cool. Probably should have saved that potion for a time when I actually needed it. Like if I was running across that uh, big dark room again. I forget what it's called. Oh, and I did just recently figure out that uh, that first area we spawned in, supposedly, according to Vex, it's called the Cenote of the, of the Apprentice. Blah, 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 blah. Cenote of the Apprentice. It's a Spanish word, actually. Um, for a big hole with water in it, according to Vex. Uh -huh. And he figured big hole with water in it of the Apprentice. Just didn't quite sound right. And I'm inclined to agree with him. Okay, let's come back in here. Let's look around. Make sure there's no wall in here that I managed to miss. Need a break from adventure? Make an awesome balcony. Dig. Oh, hey! This goes right to the cenote of the apprentice. Oh, I didn't realize that. Man, see, if I'd found that before, that would have been useful knowledge. See, Vex actually set up a little, like, he's, he did a little, he's doing a little playthrough of the map and doing developer commentary and stuff on it. And I wonder if this stuff burns down. It would make things so much easier for me. Uh, oh, never mind. There's tons of wool here. That'd be an awful idea. <laughs> okay, so we've got white, orange, magenta, light, gray wool, light gray wool, cyan, purple, blue, brown. And brown wool we got because that was hidden by the nether portal, which I think was like light gray or gray wool. Um, <clears throat> we have red wool. Just need the green wool. The brown wool was there. Where would the green wool be? Hmm. I forgot what's in. Oh, it was a battle sign. Let's look up. Is there anything in the ceiling? <laughs> no. All right. Um. Hmm. Library Tenuous Crystals. Cenote of the Apprentice. Okay, so Tenuous Crystals goes this way. We've, like, revisited all of the areas recently, and I don't see anything there that could be used as... or that could be construed as containing wool. You know? Skeletons really just make me angry. They're so cheap! It's just not even fair. The spider died because he was on fire. Oh. Zombie fell. Um, I just feel like lighting this up now. I mean, I never really got around to it before, but, but lag. Um, okay. So. Let's see. We can take that off now. <laughs> not really underwater anymore. I just put that on when we went in because I know there was that waterfall. We got one of them in that place originally, so I figured we might as well just... Take it in with us. Might be useful. Ow. Did he just break something? Almost broke something. Um. Okay. So. Uh, sorry, guys. I'm trying to think here. Um. Okay. We're going to head over to the University of Arcane Enchants and see if we miss something. I almost thought about taking it down just because it was there, and I don't know, I just have this urge to remove a lot of the signs that Vex puts down, um, because it's like once I've read them, I want to remove them saying, like, as a, hey, I read this kind of thing. Not you know, for any particular reason, just because. Um, 
Okay, maybe there's something special about that glowstone. Because remember there was that little pocket of air above it? Hmm. We got a wall from here, right? I think so. I think that little thing down there was all us. Or things getting blown up by gas and or creepers. Um, let's head in here. And up. And there's probably like zombies or something spawning. Yeah, there's a zombie in there. Um, some bed in there. This is just going to cause trouble. Oops, I didn't mean to break that. I'm just going to cause trouble, apparently. Paper. Nothing interesting. Um, more paper. Did I, did I ever set my spawn in there? Because I think I intended to at one point. I don't actually know if I did or not. We have... Oh, that's an actual glass block. I was like, wow, that glass pane actually worked right. And then I got all confused because glass panes don't go sideways. Yet that one did. <laughs> Or was this the green wall, and I just managed to uh, die and lose it, and then forget that I lost it? No? Alright. More books. Well, there's some nether wart here, and arrows, and sugar canes. I don't really know why I want any of those, but... Uh, I have plenty of all of them. Nope, light gray wool. I stored some extra crap in here. And whoa, whoa. Oop. So. Let's see. Can we safely drop into the water? I think we can. So, uh. Let us try that. There we go. And let's see. We came over here. This is where we got the brown wool from, which was that giant chest in a chest in a chest thing. Um, God, I swim so slowly. I hate how slowly you swim in Minecraft. It's ridiculous. Um, you know, it's just like, come on. I mean, I may not be able to swim as fast as I can run, but I can at least... You know, it's not that bad, at the very least. Let's just come down here and break all these and see if we can't get something out of it. No? Alright, I guess it was just a mistake then. Um, probably tried to fill in any empty air spots within a certain space and just missed part of it down here. Uh, and by fill in, I mean with water. Um, because I'm sure he doesn't do this all by hand. So he probably, um, just used a tool that, like, filled in this height from in a rectangle around here, just replaced any air blocks, and didn't get that little lowest part down there. That's my guess. Oh, that was the, uh, the, I can't remember what it's called. That advanced OpenGL, that's what it is, uh, thing going on there. Every once in a while it'll make it so that your stuff just... Whoa, look at the lighting. <laughs> what level am I on here? 27, that must be where the, uh, the bedrock fog starts. Because I have no other explanation for it. Oh, laggy laggy. Laggy laggy laggy. Okay, anytime now. Fleeception. Quite possibly the work of a capricious conjuration student with too much time on his hands. Okay, guys, I'm at two frames per second right now. Uh, from the, what I saw with the last recording, uh, you guys can still hear me just fine, but okay, this is ridiculous here. Um, I don't know why I'm at so low frame, frame rate here. Uh, okay. I think I'm going to end this episode as soon as this lag finishes. Um, if it finishes. This is ridiculous. Um, 
I don't know what's going on, guys. I don't know why this is happening. Oh, we went up to two for a second there. Okay. Well, if you guys can hear this, uh, I'm going to end the episode here. So, thanks for watching, and I guess I'll see you next time. Hopefully we'll find that next wool, because I don't know what happened to it. So, yeah, uh, see ya.